Mr. YouTube 59 just a little quick video got a question to ask you guys uh, working on a different building to uh, put my motorcycles in a little bigger give me a little more room uh, actually some room to move around and, and work on them <coughs> this is actually a 12 by 12 where the other building was only a 7 by 10 <coughs> so you can see a lot more room for the bikes so but anyway uh, a little bigger building that goes into my main building so anyway gives me a little bigger building uh, gives me a little room to move around in here don't feel like I'm so crowded up and cramped up so it gives me a little more room the Suzuki everybody's seen that one that I just got back I took it for a little ride just got back and everybody remembers the Honda 750 CB 750 this is the one I bought as or traded for it didn't really buy it I traded for it but um been trying to put it back together by no means trying to put it back to showroom uh, uh, abilities or anything like that or for show just something that I can ride that's clean and <coughs> just something vintage uh, not interested in it being perfect not interested in everything being shiny and brand new uh, just just a cleaned up bike that I can ride but here's my question and please comment Went to the beach a few weeks ago and uh, had a little fishing trip and went into a custom bike shop. Had all kind of custom bikes in there. And we got to talking and I told him what I had here working on it and um, what I was doing. And he wants to purchase this bike. Said that uh, the 750s are kind of hard for him to find. He said he loves to rebuild and customize the 750s. He said he's done a couple of bobbers in the past. He's done a couple of cafe racers in the past. And he's looking for one right now to do a bobber. So he wants me to uh, think about it and think as to whether I'm interested in selling it. And... Uh, call him with maybe a price or maybe we can negotiate a price and possibly selling this one to him to make a bobber uh, he said that he would like to make a custom bobber so my question now is what would you guys do would you consider selling it if the money's right uh, or would you if you were in my shoes would you keep it go ahead and finish it and, and ride it that's a good question <clears throat> because if I sell it to him, I'll probably just take the money that I get off of it and turn it around and put it back into another Suzuki. Uh, I don't know, but uh, I did find a Suzuki that I would like to have that is a bobber. Uh, and then I would have two Suzukis here instead of a Suzuki and a Honda. Uh, the one I found is a 1987 Honda 750. Uh, very nice looking bike at what I think is a fair and good price. But like I said, he is interested in this one. So should I call him and try to negotiate a price with him? Or what should I do? I mean, I've put a little bit of work into this thing. It's not anything outrageous that I've put into it. Uh, very little money, just a lot of elbow. Um, but what would you do at this point? What do you think I should do? That's, I guess that's the question. What do you think I should do? Should I keep this and continue? Or should I call him and see what kind of offer he's got? I would really appreciate it if you would comment. Share this so maybe other people will see it and comment. It's not anything I'm in any hurry to do, but he said he didn't, didn't matter to him if it was a year down the road. If I decided I wanted to sell it, that he would love to have it. So, as always, play hard, play safe. Don't play stupid. What would you do? Thank you for watching.